DNA fingerprinting is a method of identification based on an individual's DNA. In traditional DNA fingerprinting, the DNA is collected from cells such as a blood sample and cut into small pieces using a restriction enzyme. This generates thousands of DNA fragments of differing sizes. The fragments are then separated on the basis of size using gel electrophoresis. The separated fragments are then transferred to a nitrocellulose or nylon filter. This is called a gel blot. The DNA fragments within the blot are permanently fixed to the filter and the DNA strands are denatured. Radio labeled probe molecules are then added that are complementary to sequences in the genome that contain repeat sequences. These repeat sequences tend to vary in their length among different individuals and are called variable number of tandem repeat sequences or VNTRs. The probe molecules hybridize to DNA fragments containing the repeat sequence and excess probe molecules are washed away. The blot is then exposed to an X-ray film. Fragments of DNA that have bound the probe appear as dark bands on the film. As seen here, the samples designated 1 and 2 have a different pattern of bands, indicating that they came from two different individuals. Traditional DNA fingerprinting has been superseded by an automated procedure in which microsatellites, which also contain variable repeat sequences, are amplified by PCR. The small amplified DNA fragments are fluorescently labeled and subjected to high-resolution gel electrophoresis. A fluorescence detector determines the amount of DNA in each amplified fragment, thereby generating a graph that depicts the pattern of fragments in a particular individual.